Hello friends, you are watching Android Tech Solutions. So I am today in this video, I will show you how can you install Jenkins in CentOS 7. So first of all, you need to install Java as Jenkins depends upon Java. So you have to run this command yum install Java. Okay, now open your web browser and here you have to go to a website called pkg.jenkins.io So this is the website you have to go to which is pkg.jenkins.io I have given the link in the description of this URL so You can directly click on this uh, link and you can uh, come here to this page And here you have to choose Red Hat, Red Hat Stable, this one and here it will give you the commands to uh, set up the Jenkins repository. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and copy the first command, which is uh, downloading a repository. Okay. Okay. Now you have to just copy paste that command. So this will this command will download the repository of Jenkins. And after that, we have to install a key, the GPG key. We have to import a key. Okay. Now here it says you will be need uh, you need to install Java. Okay. Here you can see it says you have to install Java, and for the latest version you will require Java 8. Okay. Uh, by running that command, you have installed Java. We have installed Java 8 by default. And next it says us to install Java uh, Jenkins by running this command. You have installed Jenkins. Okay, Jenkins is now installed. After that, you need to start the service of Jenkins by running this command systemctl start Jenkins. And to verify whether the service is running or not, you can run this command systemctl status Jenkins. And here it says the service is running. Now you can enable the service. Uh, enabling the service will what it will be doing uh, after you reboot your machine the service will be still up and running okay. Next thing you need to do is you have to uh, apply the firewall rule Firewall hyphen cmd hyphen hyphen permanent add port 8080 tcp as Jenkins works on 8080 port And then we will reload the firewall and now I'm just going to open my web browser before opening the web browser I will check my IP address so this is my IP address and I'm going to access my Jenkins server by this IP address you can access by your local host also so I'll just copy paste the IP address of my server and I'll open 8080 port so here it says uh, it says us to unlock Jenkins. So what I will be doing, I will be just copying this path. Here in this path, you will get the default Jenkins admin password. Yeah. So here you can see this is the password. I've cat that file. I'll just copy this, and I'll just paste it over here. Next, it asks you to install plugins. So I will be going with the default settings, which will be install suggested plugins. So now it will be starting installing the plugins, the default plugins. Okay, the plugin installation has been completed. Now it says to create an admin user. So I'm just going to give the username. Okay. 
okay i'd say jenkins is ready okay guys we have successfully installed jenkins and i'm logged into with the jenkins dashboard so thank you guys for watching this video do like this video and subscribe to my youtube channel for more amazing tutorials